right, let's get into the next strategy. How to find the keywords that an Amazon product is advertising for. Why would you want to know this? And how can this bring you money? If you have a newer product, uh, of course, you can just start blindly and, and make an Amazon auto PPC campaign and see what keywords work for you and what keywords don't work for you. But that's going to cost money. Why not start from day one, reverse engineering what your competitors who maybe have been selling for months or even a couple years, reverse engineer their PPC success. All right. How can you do that? Let me show you. You, after doing your regular Cerebro search, just like you found the organic keywords, it's the same exact search. And you want to look at the column that says sponsored rank. Basically what that means is the last time Helium 10 checked, where was this product ranking for in the sponsored results? All right, these are sponsored product ads. Now sponsored product ads, these are specifically the ones that come up uh, throughout the Amazon search results. And you'll see a, a little tag that says sponsored on it, whether you're in mobile or desktop. So uh, this would be position one sponsored, position two sponsored, uh, and then three and four and so on would be kind of further down the list. But for any product, you are now going to be able to just go in there and enter in to the uh, filter at the very top under sponsored rank and say, hey, show me all the keywords that this product was detected in the top, let's just say 10 positions in sponsored rank. And then once I hit apply filters, uh, I can see now every single keyword that this product had shown up for uh, in sponsored ads. If I want to filter out the match type of only PPC keywords, I would select sponsored product, which is the second one. And it's going to show me any product or any keyword that this product was showing up in search results with any rank. Now, one interesting kind of hack here, um, this search results that I was doing for this coffin shelf, it actually came up with over 300 keywords, right? Now, just that in itself gives you some information. You can kind of tell that, okay, this person is probably doing maybe an auto campaign or broad campaign. That's why he's showing up in sponsor results for so many keywords. But guess what? Sometimes when you run Cerebro on one of your competitors' ASINs, you might notice that the sponsored keywords is only like 10 or 15. And what does that tell you? that's going to tell you that you now know their exact PPC strategy because it means they're not running a broad campaign, a broad match campaign. They're not running an auto campaign. Otherwise, hundreds of keywords would show up. So then now you know that they're only running exact match campaigns and you have their exact 15 keywords, the only keywords that they're bidding on. So, you know, you could kind of deduce if they're a very successful seller. Well, wow. You know, this seller must see a lot of profit on these 15 keywords, which is why these are the only ones they're focusing on. And now you get to benefit from probably all their trial and error and money that they spent to get that information. So that's a super cool uh, kind of like mini hack there as well when you're looking at the sponsored results. Uh, one other column you're going to see in Cerebro is suggested PPC bid. If we have enough data for a certain keyword, we'll give you a bid range that gives you the best chance, according to our estimates, to get on page one of the sponsored results. All right, it's based on the Amazon bid suggestion, but then we layer on top of it our own AI and algorithm to try and get that a little bit closer than what the Amazon bid is suggesting for you. Mm -hmm.